everyone welcome back to my channel i'm here to do another bag review um i've actually just done another one and i mentioned in that video that i'll be doing maybe like three today um just because i've been on vacation and i've been behind and i'm trying to catch up i have a lot of new bags to share with you and i've been using it uh for the past on and off for the past uh, month and a half or two um so i have really been enjoying these ones and i really wanted to share them with you um right now i'm going to review a henry bendel bag and it is called the west 57th um school bag and it looks like this i have the one that has the plaid um print design but it is um just like a calf leather pebbled calf leather as you can see um it's very durable um it, it's very cute um so yeah it has like a two section as you can see here it has the henry bendel um uh, new york uh logo and yeah that's pretty much what it looks like on the outside it has these two turn lock closures and a top handle it also comes with a crossbody strap um right here and this one is interchangeable so because it's um uh you uh, removable and adjustable so you could you could change it with something else and you clip this easily with these um deep lobster clasp right on the top where the um top handles are and then you can make this into a crossbody. I will wear this for you just to show you what it looks like a little bit later. Right now, I'm going to show you what's inside. So to get inside this bag, um, you know, uh, oh, actually, let me, I forgot to mention, there is a slip pocket right here where um, I easily could fit my phone in there. So it looks like that. So you can easily take it in and out without having to worry about opening this bag um, every time, you know, you need to access your phone. Um, so this bag is pretty compact um that's what i really like about it and it's still very um safe so you know no one's going to get into it because you do have to unlock these um and then you easily open it up like that and then when you close it you just push it back into these um turn locks so inside like i mentioned is um two compartments i really like this feature actually because um i like to keep my wallet in one and like all the other random things in the other so um it keeps my wallet easy to reach for and accessible without having to dig through my bag and not that this is a big bag but it also allows um things to not scratch my wallet or scratch each other um so it's just kind of like come has a compartment but without being too crazy um so i'm just going to take it out for you in the back like i said all i have is my wallet um i have my louis vuitton emily wallet and it's in the monogram rose ballerine color it's a continental wallet it just snaps open and close like this um so yeah and that fits snugly nicely in here it protects it it has this wonderful um like satin feeling blue um, lining so it's very luxurious on the back here which i don't use is a zip pocket um it's very very like snug like i can barely fit my hand in there so i don't really keep anything in there um but it, it is it is an option if you wanted to so that's all there is in the back in the front compartment i have my sunglass case this one is actually my stella and dot sunglass and eyeglass case so it is very bulky i normally probably <laughs> I will probably not bring this one with me in this bag just because it's so bulky but even with that in there as you can see it wasn't too bad you know um but it is very like space taking i might bring another one with me instead and all i have left here is my car keys um and then like a chapstick or a lipstick um sometimes if i am going depending on where i'm going i also have a pack of tissue or like um maybe a pen but that easily fits in here no problem as well um so yeah now i've taken everything out you can kind of see what it looks like let me see if i have a better angle there we go so yeah it's very spacious um very like soft and luxurious it looks really cute um yeah so with with closing it it's just like that um sometimes i don't even twist it because it's you know if i'm going in and out of my bag a lot but um it's it's quite easy you just do that and it's closed so it looks really cute um and it's very light without anything in it so that's really what i really like about it um it's like i said very durable i've used it a few times now and um i don't i mean i don't baby this one at all um generally with darker bags i don't but this one's also very like you know um sturdy so i don't think anything's gonna happen to it it doesn't have feet just because of the way it's designed but i think you should be able to um do okay without um damaging it just because it has these pipings it looks pretty sturdy um i haven't had any problems with it 
So let me just um, try this or show you what it looks like on me so that you can see. Um, for reference, I'm 5'1", so um, yeah, you can kind of gauge what this looks like on you. That's one of the things I really like about this bag because um, it is just so um, perfect in size to fit everything I need, but it also can fit, um, or it can fit everything I need, but it's not too big. So here's what it looks like. Um, if I were to carry it just by the top handle and say like I don't have this um, attached, it would look like this. It's very easy. Um, it's big enough for you to put it on your wrist, but not. I don't think you can put, even put it on your elbows. It's a little too tight, I think. Um, but if you put on the crossbody strap, or actually I wouldn't say it's crossbody. I would say it's a shoulder strap. This is what it looks like. Um, this shoulder strap is right now on the loosest setting. So for 5-1, you can make it tighter so that it'll sit higher, like, an, like a shorter shoulder um, bag. But I don't think you can wear crossbody. For me, I put it crossbody. This is the loosest. Um, if you're any taller than me, it'll look a little ridiculous. I think this one's like still very um, fitted. Um, I would do this if I'm like running around and like don't want to drop my bag, but otherwise I think the most comfortable way is to carry it on the shoulder, on one shoulder. So yeah, that's what it looks like on me. Um, it looks very, I think it looks very nice. I got it on sale. I got it for about $200 on sale, but I believe it retails for $328. I'll, I'll double check on it and then I'll put it in the description bar below. But um, yeah, it's it's a very good deal. They have a lot of other styles. Um, this one, again, like I said, is the tweed pattern. Um, it's not actual tweed, it's just the, the print. But they also come in many different colors, a lot of fall colors, winter colors coming out. Um, I believe... Um, let's see the solid ones the solid ones I remember they're a little cheaper so I think it's 298 the print ones and some like some things that have like little tassels those are 328 a little bit more expensive but again if you wait for a sale which Henry Bendel does um, from time to time um, you can get it at an actually pretty good deal so yeah I'll put the dimensions in the description description bar below and if you have any other questions leave them in the comments and I'll try mm -hmm. to answer them um otherwise I will see you in my next video thanks for watching bye